Horses, Horses River and Yago are two of the only 400 marsh tackies left in existence. NBC Charlotte's Brandon Goldner spoke to the horse's owner who works at Winthrop University. Brandon, you learned people all over the country have sent her messages of support. That's right, Fred and Sarah. She's heard from people in all 50 states as she desperately tries to search for two horses who have incredible personal meaning to her. Hey, what goes through your mind when you see this? I just feel sick. I... <laughs> this is the first time Jackie McFadden is seeing these photos. What's left after someone broke into this gate to steal her two horses, River and Yago? It's a nightmare. It's... They're, it's part of my family that's out there, and I need to bring them home. For years, Jackie's fought on behalf of horses like them. They're extremely rare marsh tackies. Less than 400 still exist in the world. She helped push lawmakers to designate the breed as South Carolina's official state horse. So to celebrate, a friend of Jackie's took her to his marsh tacky farm. Whichever horse she connected with would be hers. I couldn't take my eyes off of her, and she was strong and beautiful. That horse was River. She looked into my eyes and looked into my soul and stole my heart. She and her husband made River and her companion, Yago. There's no way we could ever separate those two. Part of their family. And I promised the horses that I would never sell them. They were, they were our horses for a lifetime. Now she's once again fighting to keep that promise and find her stolen horses. Her search has spread nationally on social media. She's determined to bring them home. I've got to find her. I've got to get her back. <laughs> Now, there is a $2,000 reward for any information leading to their location. Reporting live, I'm Brandon Goldner, NBC Charlotte. All right, thanks, Brandon. Hopefully, they're found and brought home oh, safely. Yeah. There's 